Captain's log, we made it. It's uh, Saturday morning, I think. I don't care um, at this point because I'm not at work for a long time. Anyway, uh, hotel room tour. I mean, this place is pretty nice. Uh, you walk in the front door, which is right here behind me. I mean, it really is nice as my apartment was in Washington State. You turn over into the left here, we've got the kitchen area complete with a uh, little sink, little oven, little stove top thing, microwave, fridge freezer, freaking washer and dryer. Washer and dryer in my hotel room, mini bar. Coming back around, we have, I'll turn you around, there we go, yeah buddy, the entranceway, the primary room, the dining facilities, the lounging facilities, the TV, we'll go outside in a second. In the interim, we're gonna take you into the bathroom, check it out, lights on, everybody. There we go. Uh, mood lighting for the tub. Don't know if you can see that. Hold on a second. It'll come on in a second. Uh, vanities, shower stall. Hey, <laughs> they got a pooper and they're ready for the people from the States because they got a pooper washing up line too. We need to bring that stuff back to America, right? And over here, the shower stall. Yeah, it's got the rain attachment and the lady wand. I love it. Uh, walking right in through here into the master bedroom. Uh, ignore the mess. I was wiped out when I came in last night. Got the laptop set up in. Had to do a couple of things for the house this morning. More to come on that later. And rolling around, we have the outside. So yeah, so let's see what we got going on here. A little chase lounge, a couple of chair action, towel rack going on. And uh, yeah. I think I'm gonna be able to get used to this and possibly relax for a few days. Captain out. <laughs> Captain's log. It's early, I know. I couldn't sleep. I think I might be able to get used to this. I mean, if I'm doing the math, it's cheaper for me to stay here at this resort than it is to buy a house in Mississippi. Yeah, that's a long story. But anyway, I think the resort's a little nicer. So we'll see how that goes. Captain's gonna go out and dig on the beach here for a minute, see what's up. Uh, it doesn't look like I'm gonna be doing much swimming today because the surf is <laughs> up. And uh, as they would tell me in Hawaii, well, brah, you want the kind of light to get in the water today. All right, brah, stay safe out there. Captain, out. Kevin's log, I was on my way to the beach. I was going to the beach, I really was. But the beach is red flagged and the surf's up. And I'm too fat and old to try to get in there and body surf and almost die. Then I found this thing, right? Put a picture of it upside, outside. But I'll turn you around and show you what I'm looking at. Oh yeah, oh that's nice. Uh-huh, right? And the ocean is right over there. And I'm right here and there's pillows. There's a dude just getting ready to open up. He's gonna start bringing drinks around. And uh, yeah, yeah, I think it'll be here for a hot minute. All right, cap him out. Kept his log. It started raining at the beach. So I had to come take refuge in a bar. Um, nice place. They have fresh seafood. You know, I know they have fresh seafood. That's the seafood. It's fresh. Here we go. Captain L. Captain 
Pete's log, change of venue, hotel pool. I'm going to get used to this. Captain out. Captain's log. Um, as you may guys may know, I'm a man of the people, right? And uh, one of the things that I love to do more than anything else is come out and find the restaurants of the people. And while there's a lot of really nice restaurants on the resort property, I mean, check this place out. We're gonna find some food here. It's gonna be good. Either that or I might die, but we'll see. If this video gets published, you'll know what happened. Hate to spoil it for you though. Captain out. Captain's log, lunchtime. Check this out. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, this is where I'm having lunch. Two beers, chicken satay, spring rolls. I don't know, probably looking at about $4. Life is good, Captain out. Kevin's log. Um, got too hot at the beach, so I'm back at the pool. They both have bars. They both have sun. They both have water. It's nice. More shade at the pool this time of day, though. So that's good. But anyway, um, I just wanted to share this with you. The pool butts up next to the kids' area, and I know Brown, my father, has never been to Thailand. But there's a sign behind me. You can see it right there. And there's a letter that's been colored in that is not part of the normal sign. The little arts is something that is up there in construction paper. The F was colored in with a paint marker. I'm looking at you, Brown. Captain out. Captain's log, back at the pool, in the shade. Shout out, Susan. Um, this pool's pretty nice. Yeah, buddy. They've got little lounging areas that I've been hanging out in. And then today, I found the space where I am now. So there are these bench seats, right? And I'll turn you around in a second so you can see them. With little water jets that spray you right in the middle of your lower back. <clears throat> Which is really good when you're working your kidneys and your liver as hard as I've been these past four or five days. I mean, that massage in the middle of the afternoon between gin and tonics really, really, really helps out. You wouldn't believe me. Captain out. captain's log let me start this by saying I don't have a problem dining alone right as much as I travel as many places as I've been as often as I'm off doing somewhere or something for either work or pleasure I'm usually by myself for dinner that's totally okay it's actually a power move one of the strongest things you can do however tonight I'm having the saddest meal in the world I booked a reservation at Benihana 
yeah, no, don't don't start with me, kids. I'm going I'm going to the middle of the of the of the homeland of Thailand tomorrow. So it's my last Western meal. I'm by myself at the hibachi. This is gonna be the best, saddest meal ever. Captain Howe. He's got this watch. That's exactly what it looks like when I cook at home. Ah, you can try, huh? I recommend oh, you can Yeah! Yeah! Oh, okay. You're looking, okay. Welcome to three, right? And four, dancing, huh? Oh, dancing. Yeah! Dancing, huh? Are you ready? Ready. Go! One, two, three! Captain's log. So I just recorded this. And then I realized I had to re-record it because I say things out of order sometimes on how the video is going to get cut. And um, I just had the best sad meal in my life. I mean, granted, I'm still the only one at Tabanyaki, right? Totally by myself. But my boy Kay let me cook. If you know me, you know my dream job is a short order cook at a Waffle House. Number two to that is a Benihana chef. But I, if I were to throw a knife around somebody like that, I would kill 17 people. Well, only five people were sitting at the table. I managed to only break one egg. But you already saw that. So, Captain Elf. And yes, I am wearing a kid's menu for a half right now.